Howdy folks, this is Skippy and his long-suffering spouse presenting his famous plumber's horn. Now the reason I built this is because I didn't want to spend the money on a proper Leslie horn. I have since acquired a Leslie speaker with a horn but never mind this is as good I reckon. Inside is a two-speed 240 volt Leslie motor stuck which originated from a con oh what was the model again I forgot doesn't matter an old con spinet and it does the job just beautifully this is the horn I made from 50 mil plumbing pipes consisting of a 90 degree bend a bit of 50 mil plumbing pipe fashioned and fitted to the 90 degree bend which is the dummy horn as a counterweight and into the opening of the bend fits this end which is the actual active horn now I can replace this active horn, pull it out and replace it by this thing here which is my own idea an oval shaped 50 mil plumbing horn and that's what uh, the proper Leslie's use a uh, horn with a deflector on it supposed to increase FM modulation. Now I personally prefer the current setup as it is here which is just an open horn uh, which is supposed to give you, more, give you more AM amplification. On the bottom of it I've got the uh, bit of plumbing pipe glued into the bend which I machined down to fit into this bearing here. And inside the bearing is a cheap $25 J-car tweeter which you can't see maybe just a moment a bit of light may help but it does the job and driving the actual horn is a pulley made out of wood which is this thing here I'm a carpenter and I've got a lathe and I'll, I just machined it to suit and I had to machine it to a diameter so I could achieve 400 rpm at fast around about and 40 rpm at slow approx well as you can see I didn't quite get there but gee that's close now all this is sitting on an old beaten up Leslie 705 working perfectly now the way I control the horn speed motors uh, I tapped into the control circuit of the Leslie 705 which is a, a low voltage uh, DC current and uh, I'm operating the motors of the Leslie horn via 240 volt relays switched by the current coming from the Leslie 705 switching circuit that's all housed in here I'm taking the rotary channel signal from the 705 through the stereo amp into the uh, plumber's horn 
and the main channel signal of the 705 through the same stereo amp into a Servin Vega box gives me a little bit of extra oomph I customized the frequencies uh, via this EQ it works just fine uh, well almost like a crossover oh yes and if you wonder how I modify the bend and how I modify the ends I used a hot air gun I tried immersing uh, the PVC pipes into uh, boiling water that wasn't hot enough so you will have to use a hot air gun to modify the openings and to modify the bend and uh, to get the openings like this I used a conical piece of wood I machined uh, and lubricated with uh, liquid soap and while I was heating up the end pushing it down but this is about the absolute limit if you try to open it up anymore it will crack okay good luck you may end up with a few pieces of uh, cracked pipes but they're pretty cheap 